Welcome back, everybody, to Gold Rush. I'm an old guy gaming, and we are going to continue uh, the mining tutorial stage one. So if you didn't catch the last episode, uh, we went through, like, the prologue, uh, where we worked with some large equipment, and that was a lot of fun. Uh, and then we started the tutorial proper, and we did our first um, tier one with some, you know, the most basic mining equipment that you can get. Um, and we made ourselves some money. So if you look in the upper right hand corner, we now have $804. Make you holla. And so we're going to continue um, the uh, stage one tutorial or tier one tutorial. If uh, we open up our journal here, um, we have did these first few pages. So now we're here at step 15 where we're going to get some tier one extensions. Um, and so basically we're going to buy all this stuff. Plus we need to buy some gasoline and then go back out to our claim that we're renting and put it all together and uh it wants us to get up to twenty three thousand dollars okay so that's pretty much where we are and um let's go ahead and do it so we want to get in our vehicle here and start her up let's get into this view because it's just a little bit easier to see what's going on and then um let's go to the warehouse which i think is down this way Still trying to get used to where everything is. Yeah, the warehouse is here. This is where we buy all of our stuff. Okay. Turn the vehicle off. All right, so let's see here. We need to buy ourselves a hog pan with a pump in it. Got one of those. We need to buy two more hog pan mats. We need to buy this small diesel water pump, small electric water pump. Oh, that's expensive. Yeah, okay. No, this is the one we want is the diesel. Get one of those. Uh, we're going to need some hoses. So we're going to need a, thin, a fat water hose and a thin water hose. Uh, let's see what else uh, we're gonna need a filter where would those be at some tape oh we are gonna want a, 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 a fuel can too so let's get one of those okay somewhere around here there's supposed to be some filters too that's duct tape. All right, where the heck's the filters? You'd think they'd be over here by the the hoses, right? Let's look again. Maybe I just missed them. Nothing down there seems to look like filters. Those are electrical cords. Um, all right, let's go look over here. Spare, spare parts. Do we go in here? I haven't been in here before. There's springs. Reinforced work light lamps. Uh, oh, here we go. Water filter. Okay. So let's grab one of those. Let's go back to the journal and uh, make sure we have everything. So we've got this small water pump. We've got a fat hose, a thin hose, two hog pan maps, a water filter, a hog pan pump. Oh, we got to get the sluice box extension as well. And then we got we got some gas too. Okay, so sluice box extension is going to be this thing right here. Here, hog pan sluice buck extension. Right. Okay. So we'll grab that too. Add that to the list. All right. I think that's everything we were supposed to get. Let's go here. And this is going to cost us a total of $687. And it should be out here waiting for us. And then we still have $117 left over that we can use for gasoline. All right. Let's start loading stuff up. So we'll put the little stuff in first. Oh, what did I just do? Oh, 
I'm picking something up off of this, not meaning to. Water pump filter detach. Oh, okay. That was weird. All right, put that in there. The hog pan can go here. The hose can go there. I'm going to stay in. And then the big guy. Uh, are you in there far enough? There. That's probably good. Okay. So I think we loaded everything in we were supposed to do. Uh, now what we want to do is go get some gas. I did see the gas station somewhere um, in town here. I just don't remember exactly where it was. Uh, we can look on the map if we have to. Let's go this way. This kind of leads us out of town, doesn't it? Oh, yeah, that goes to the blacksmith. Okay, hold on. Whoop, crash. Go back into Haynes. Past the warehouse. I think the gas might be on this end of town. Yeah, there's the church. I remember coming this way before. Here we go. Okay. So let's pull into here. Turn that thing off. All right, so let's grab our gas can. And we'll set it down here by the pump. Grab that. Grab that. Um, we might as well fill it all the way up. That's going to cost us 40 bucks. Did, did it work? Wait a minute. Okay, hold on. It must have, because it's not letting me... Hold on. How do I know if this is full? Oh. I think it's the red... Yeah, I think it's the red view viewport thingy there. Okay. Um, all right, now uh, we have still have $76, so why don't we put gas in our vehicle, too? Refuel. Okay, that's done. All right, we got our gas. Got all of our stuff. It's time to head back out to our claim. Yep, our fuel tank is full. Very nice. Okay, so our claim is back this way, I believe. Yeah, we already know that. Don't show that message again. Last time that message popped up, I crashed into the fence, too. <laughs> Come on, game. Knock that stuff off. Okay, let's go. We basically are broke now. We've spent every last dime we had on this equipment and this gas, so let's hope uh, let's hope we can turn a little bit of a profit here. We gotta recoup our money and turn a little bit of a profit. Okay, we are here. So let's grab the Ginny first, and we're going to need to take it over here. It's going to have to hit the water and the back of the thing. So I think we'll set it right here maybe. Yeah, that seems seems to be a, a good spot for that. Okay. Now we come over here. Let's grab the extension for the sluice box. It's really hard to see where you're going. 
And that's going to go right here. Nice. Okay. We'll take the hose. And that connects into the end of the water pump right there. And then we put the rest in the water. What's... Wind the cable. What's that mean? Okay. Try that again. Connect that to there. Right to wind the cable. Alright, I'm, I'm confused. What am I doing wrong? Oh! Oh, that's an output. Oh, okay, okay. I'm putting it in the wrong spot. You know what we need to do then is we need to actually turn this around because, yeah, I think we want it this way. There we go. All right. Let's try this again. Use and then it still says wind the cable. What the heck am I doing wrong? All right, here, let's go to the journal. Oh, oh, do we have to set it in the water first, then put the filter? Oh, okay, maybe we're just doing this in the wrong order. All right, let's set that down there. Let's grab the filter. Okay, the filter's on there. Pick up the water hose, drop it in the water. Now pick up this in. Oh, no, that still didn't work. Okay. I press E. Oh, I press E. Okay, it didn't say to press E. <laughs> okay, we got it. We got it. All right, now uh, let's go get the hog pen with the pump. And we're going to have to take this hog pen off of here, and I guess we'll just set that there. I wonder if we can sell that and get a little money back. I don't know. Let's put that here. Now we want to get the small hose. Whoops. Go this way. And this connects to this output. And then connects to here. There we go. All right, I think I did that right. Seems seems so. All right, let's go get the miner's moss thingies. So we should be able to double our capacity uh, with this setup, but also, you know, make it go faster too, because we won't have to do the the watering portion of this. Last thing we need to do is get our fuel and fill up the thing. Oh, it's sitting right down there here. Let's grab it here. Okay. Nice. Okay, pick up jerry can. And we still have quite a bit of fuel left in here, too. Um, I guess we might as well just keep this here. Let's just set it down here by the tree. Don't fall. <laughs> there we go. Okay. All right, my friends. I think we're ready to do this. So... Uh, we got to start this guy up. And how do we do that? Is there a button? Oh, there's a pull handle. Okay. Right on. Look at that. Awesome. It's running the water through for us. Fantastic. Okay, let's get our shovel out with the number two key. And this time we, we're going to fill all four of these up to 100%. Let's get digging here. All right, we are at 99%. Is that going to get us up to 100? Yes, it does. Awesome. Okay, so uh, I think the first thing we do is turn this guy off. That took us 73 down to 73% of the fuel. Um, 
how do we turn this turn this guy off? Out. Water pump filter detach. Switch. There we go. Okay. And it's getting dark too, but that's fine because what we can do now is uh, bring our mats into here and do our stuff inside the tent. So let's go get our bucket. I don't know um, how much of this we can put into a single bucket, so I, it'll probably tell us if it gets to capacity. Put that there. Oh, we got to fill it too. Okay. We know we can at least do two of these because that's what we did the last time. Okay, nice. Can we get all four of them in one bucket? It would appear so. Very nice. Okay. Um, so we'll just leave all of this stuff here. We'll grab our bucket and head on into the tent to do some gold panning. Excited to see how much we're going to get this time. Should be quite a bit more than the first time because we, we doubled our mats and we did 40%. Uh, uh, or we went up to 100% this time. All right. Grab this. Start doing some panning here. So get that down in the water, back up. I'm seeing some nuggets in there. I don't know how long you're supposed to shake this. But let's just shake it that long. Yeah, there's definitely more nuggets in there this time than there were the, was the first time we did all of this. Okay, let's pick some gold out. Nice. The tweezers mean bigger nuggets. That one needed the little suction cup. And there's another one here. Okay, let's just make sure we didn't miss anything in this little batch. Don't think so. Okay, so we'll just dump it out. And uh, get out of panning mode and put this down here. Okay. So my assumption is we'll be able to fill this up four times because... Again, you know, we doubled up what we did before. Let's get that down in the water, get it back up. Start doing some swishing around, baby. Okay. Go into picking mode. There's a big nugget. We'll take that. Move this around a little more. That's a squeeze bottle nugget. These are all going to be squeeze bottles here. Okay, can I get to that one? Looks like we're going to have to tip this a bit. Okay. Come on. All right, why are you not picking those? I can't seem to get to those nuggets for some reason. What the heck's going on here? Okay, if we get out of pick mode and back into it, now can we do it? Oh man, I don't want to lose those nuggets. Maybe we have to rinse it some more. Okay, now let's pour this out. There we go. Ooh, and that's a tweezer one too. We definitely didn't want to miss that one. So I guess we had to rinse it some more. I don't know, but we're up to 12.235 grams so far. Was pretty. That's pretty good. Uh, all right, let's dump out the, the dirt, get out of this mode and out of this mode. 
And we should be able to do this two more times. Shake it up a little more here. Like I said, I don't know how much we're supposed to shake this, but that would seem to be good enough, I guess. Okay, let's dump the water out and get into picking mode. There's a nice size nugget. This one's going to be a tweezer nugget, too. The rest of these are probably suction cup nuggets. Okay, I think that's it. Let's just uh, do another dippity do just to make sure. Just to make sure we didn't miss anything. I suspect it doesn't work that way. I think we just do it the first time and then that's it. Yeah, I'm not seeing any more nuggets there. Okay, let's get rid of that. And the last time. Yep, bucket is empty. Okay. Okay, get some water and start shaking it up. Shake it up, baby, now. Let's get a little more water back in there. Okay. Drain the water out over here. Looks like that's good. Oh, we got some nice size nuggets in there, you guys. Look at that. Beautiful. Okay, let's get them. Those are all tweezer nuggets. Okay, this is a suction nugget. Okay, anything else? Okay, let's uh let's just do one more swoosh a doodle here. Wait, why is a doesn't want to go down anymore? It's like the bucket is. There we go. That was weird. That's all the further it goes. Did we like run out of water or something? Here, let's swish a doodle it there a little bit. Okay, I think that. Yeah, I think we're done. Okay. Um. Oh, I never. Uh, I never dumped that stuff out, but I don't think it matters. We'll just... Well, maybe it does. Uh, we don't want it in there for next time, so let's let's dump this out. There we go. Okay. All right, so we have 24.448 grams of gold. Uh, but it is evening, uh, so why don't we sleep, and then we'll go into town tomorrow and see... I just heard a wolf. Uh, see how much we get. Uh, the day summary. Worker salary processed pay dirt 1.77 square, meter squared. We earn 28 gold. Provision of rent in gold 8 grams. Okay, so does that mean that I didn't have to pay to rent it, but he's taking a percentage of what we're making? That would seem to be perhaps the case there. All right, well, let's head on into town here. Just want to see how much this is going to get us. Turn our lights on. Okay, we are at the blacksmith. Oh, the battery will drain if the lights are on. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's turn those lights off. Oh, it, it even has high beams. That's cool. I love it. Okay, let's see what we can do here. So we want to smelt. Oh, click smelt first. Wait, what? Find gold ore. Oh, is he like, uh... 
Not open yet? Does it say what his hours are? He must not be open yet. Okay. Uh, well, I'll tell you what then. Let's um, let's look at our journal. There's a lot of cool information in here. Okay. Blacksmith, important buildings, tablet, machine store, other machinery, magnetite. Let's read about magnetite. When you have a magnetite trailer and a magnetite separator prepared, it's time to gather some magnetite. You just you can't just simply take the dirt and put it through the magnetite separator. There's not enough magnetite in the dirt to make this working. You need to process it through a hog pan or a mobile wash plant first. The more dirt you process, the more magnetite will be in the output bucket. When ready, pour the process pay dirt into the magnetite. Okay. Alright, that's more information I'll have to, to read later. Where is... Where is the information about the, uh, the market? Do I have to be at the bank to see that? Digitube. Accessories, bank stock gold value changes every day it's good to know when to sell it right okay so that's all you're gonna tell me all right let's go back to here blacksmith you need instant money or don't have money for smelting a bar sell the gold ore Oh, that's the problem. I don't have enough money to to pay him to make that into a bar because we're flat broke. Oh, okay. I think that's what's going on there. All right. Well, let's go here then. So we're going to have to sell him some gold ore. We only get 40% of the gold price. Dang. How much do we have to... How much do we need for the bars? I have no idea. Okay, why don't we... It won't let me do just one one gram. There's no, like, fine-tune option. All right, let's do... Let's do one gram like this. Okay, so that gets us $16. Is that enough for us to... Uh, smelt now. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's going to cost 17 bucks. Just to do 4.6 grams. Okay, so we have about four times that much. So that means we're going to need... Let's just say roughly $70. Okay, so we're going to go back to sell gold ore. This sucks that we have to do it this way, but I guess, um, you know, that's just the way it is when you start out, right? There we go. Okay, let's sell that much. Well, wait, we already have 17 bucks, though, so let's actually bring this back. Let's just do 67. Okay, now we should be able to smelt everything we have. Yeah, 11.3 grams. That's going to cost us, oh, only 40 bucks. Well, because we don't have as much, right? Okay. It will take some time for the blacksmith to smelt your gold bar. You'll, need, you'll, be, you'll be notified when that happens. Oh, okay. I guess it doesn't happen instantaneously now because we're not... The tutorial's no longer giving us that for a freebie. So I guess the game tells us when that'll happen. So that means I should go back to my claim and just get going on another batch. Look at this dirt bike, man. That's cool. Um, until I get that notification. So that is what I'm going to do. I will probably... Just meet you guys back here once I get to the notification. Um, or actually, no, I'll pr what, what I'll, I'll do is I'll get the notification. I'll come back here. I'll grab the gold bar, and then I'll meet you guys at the bank to see how much money we actually make. All right, so I'll see you when that happens.
All right, guys, we are at the bank, and we got our gold bar with us. So let's take a look at the stock. So it definitely has gone up uh, from what it was before. Um, But I think that, hmm, I wonder if we should sit on this and just go mine for another day and then see what it does tomorrow. Because I'd like to see this, you know, this price uh, go up just a little bit more. Um, yeah, so I think I think that's what we'll do. Uh, if we did sell this, we're gonna get four hundred and thirty-five dollars. Really? That's it? Oh my goodness! We got to get up to twenty-three k. This is gonna t this is gonna take a while. Oh my word! All right. Well, um. What I'm going to do then, yeah, is I think I'm going to go back to the claim and just keep mining um, for this day and wait, you know, mine the whole entire day because um, we have plenty of gasoline and wait until tomorrow and see if the prices have gone up at all before we sell. So let's just sit on the gold bar that we currently have. Um Cause that that is that's not very much you know so we'll just sit on that we'll leave it in the back of the truck i guess it'll stay there hopefully nobody steals it and go um just keep mining for this day and then we'll see what the price does tomorrow uh but anyway guys that is it for this episode i hope you enjoyed and uh remember uh, make sure you hit that like button and um based upon the likes and the number of views that i'm getting on this we'll de we'll determine if we keep it going or not um, I've recorded episodes one and two back to back, uh, so I haven't seen any comments yet. Um, but um, yeah, we'll see. We'll see th how things go. But if you guys are, are liking this, like I said, um, am I going the wrong way? I think I am. Yeah, I need to actually go down here. So. Yeah, so that is it. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment to share the video. This isn't the way I'm supposed to go. Can I go through here? Maybe, maybe it's okay. Oh my goodness. All right, here, come around through here. Yeah, that w I, I don't think that's the way I was supposed to go. Okay, I'll figure it out. Look at the river though, that's cool. Whoop, these guys are gonna think I'm drunk or something. Nifty. All right, well, I, I completely screwed up my outro, so let's try it again. Guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share the video. And we will catch you in the next episode. Don't hit the street sign. There you go. Okay, see ya. Bye.